It's another big story this morning. Right now, a man is waking up behind bars. Yeah, facing charges for the death of a mother of four who was also an Uber driver in Monroeville. Now, we have followed the investigation into Christy Spacuza's death for almost a week now. L Lindsay Ward joins us live outside the Allegheny County Jail. Lindsay, the court paperwork really full of just disturbing details. Not just disturbing, but also really heartbreaking. According to that criminal complaint, Krista Spicuza was begging, saying that she had a family. This while the man who is now in jail, Calvin Crew, kept a gun pointed in the back of her head while she drove for Uber. Now, he was arrested overnight and taken to jail here. He is facing charges of criminal homicide, robbery, and tampering with evidence. According to the criminal complaint, an Uber was called February 10th, around 9 at night, to a house in Pitcairn for Crew. It was requested for a trip in Penn Hills. The paperwork says Spicuza's missing dash camera was found by officers in Penn Hills. That camera revealed that crew placed a gun to the back of Spicuza's head about 10 minutes after getting in the Uber, telling her to keep driving. Spicuza, according to the complaint, pleaded with crew, saying she has four children. The video ended after crew said, do what I say and everything will be all right. Spicuza's body was found along Rosecrest Drive in Monroeville last Saturday. Police say she was shot in the head. According to the complaint, police say GPS records show the two drove through several neighborhoods and phone records show Spacuza's cash apps were accessed. Now, Spacuza and crew then drove to Monroeville, where police say she was shot. Now, we're hoping to speak to police later this morning to find out additional details about this case. As soon as we hear more from them, we'll be sure to pass it along to you. Reporting live, I'm Lindsay Ward, KDK News.